if again, I feel like it, it's so interesting. I feel like we're just like waiting for something worse to happen. And and you can kind of see the cases in New York just go like this. So I had these research scientists, we ran a Skype interview like two days ago. And they were like, yeah, in terms of the parabola, the curve, we're probably at 10% of the first half, like given their model. Yeah. And so if the healthcare system was to get wildly overrun, you're obviously not an expert in virology, but would they by chance say, hey, Scott, like we need more doctors. Can you come to the hospital and help us? Yeah, I mean, the, so the governor just passed some regulations that allow doctors that are either in retirement or have medical licenses in other states that they can come in and practice. So, you know, there's not a lot of, of reports, Vermont, New Hampshire, Maine, you know, Maine's actually sending stuff down into Boston. Again, talking about geography, and I really love, you know, you think of viruses, and most of the time people tell you that, that, that temperature and humidity and all that stuff doesn't matter. Uh, you know, the reason you get more, more influenza in the wintertime is because we're in the room together and we spread the virus around each other. But they say, you know, if you're down warm, it's not, it, it doesn't help you. And if you're too north, it doesn't make a difference. But that may, that may not be the case for this virus in particular. First of all, it's a new virus. It's novel. It comes from an animal which we haven't, you know, haven't had before. So we truly don't know how it's going to behave. But it's really possible that, you know, that, we're gonna, that, that it may not be so bad in certain areas and really bad in other areas. And so we may have to shift around. We may have to move and do stuff to sort of accommodate that. And if it meant me coming in, you know, there's, there's a meme of, of uh, oh, God, what's his name? I can't remember. Um, but it's a famous actor, and he's got his scrubs on. And the meme is, it's like, it's Jack Nicholson. He's like, if, if you don't want an orthopedic surgeon to take care of your, of your virus, stay home. <laughs> you know, <it's> like, <laughs> so it might be likely. It could be. It could definitely be. Yeah, but I don't know. I mean, I'm we're, I, every day I keep waiting to hear, like, who's the sick person that I know? And I can honestly say I don't know a person that has COVID-19. Let's knock on wood that it stays like that. I mean, are you in Middlesex County, technically? Yeah, we are. Right? That's no, kind of we're, yeah, no, I live in North Andover. So is that That's Middlesex. Essex? No, I'm in Essex. Well, Middlesex County has like 140 cases. Yeah. And I mean, who knows how it will spread out here. 